Elvis Presley's Graceland home to be auctioned, but Riley Keough Brand's sale, fraudulent. The iconic home of Elvis Presley, Graceland, is set to be sold this Thursday, but the King of Rock and Roll's granddaughter has challenged the sales legality. Elvis Presley's home and burial site Graceland will be sold off at a foreclosure auction his granddaughter Riley Keough has accused of being fraudulent. A legal notice was published this month confirming the property and surrounding land on Elvis Presley Boulevard will be auctioned off for cash to the highest bidder at Shelby County Courthouse on Thursday, May 23, according to WREG-TV News. However, Graceland's current owner Riley, 34, has challenged the sale with a lawsuit. On Monday, a temporary restraining order was issued against the sale, via Riley's attorney, with an injunction hearing scheduled for Wednesday. According to the legal notice, the Daisy Jones and the Six actress mother, Elvis only child Lisa Marie Presley, secured a $3.8 million, £3 million, loan using Graceland as collateral by signing a deed of trust in 2018. The sum was allegedly taken through a Missouri company called Now Saini Investments and Private Lending, which claims Lisa Marie did not pay back the loan before her death last year aged 54. Now, Riley's lawsuit filed on May 15, claims her mother didn't borrow any money from the company in the first place. The lawsuit claims, these documents are fraudulent, with Riley claiming that her mother's signatures on the deed are actually forgeries. She also claims that Now Saini Investments is not actually a real company. Moreover, the notary listed on the documents has denied ever notarizing Lisa Marie's signature or even meeting her. Elvis' daughter inherited the estate after his death in 1977 before it was opened to the public as a museum in 1982. Riley became heir to the estate upon Lisa Marie's death in January 2023.